wanted to show you a cool mod that we did to the TB50 battery station. Um, as you know, it only accepts TB50s. With our modification, it will allow you to use the bigger, higher capacity TB55s. What we did was we rerouted the electronics from the upper half over to the storage area so we can utilize that for our TB55 batteries, uh, allowing you to charge, rapid charge, discharge, pretty easily. Let's dive into some of the case's features. Up top, we have two ports for charging your remote controllers. We have two, two amp USB ports, a port for updating the battery case. There's also a screen to display your battery's information. You'll have two different options when you turn on the case. Option one is regular charging. Option two is to rapid charge. After a long day's work, flip it over to discharge. You'll be greeted with an option for long-term storage and option two for short-term storage. Going through the menus will provide you with the option of seeing your battery's information. You can see on here that we have the TB55's temperature, voltage, number of cycles, and overall status. If you're working in a sound sensitive environment, switching over to silent mode will put you in a silent but a lower powered mode. We designed and printed housings that will accommodate up to four TB55s. We made them from an impact, heat, and UV resistant polymer while still incorporating the active cooling from the battery station. If you want to check this mod out yourself, stop by the showroom, Google Innovative UAS. If you want to snag one for yourself and you're not near us, visit us on InnovativeUAS.com. We are on Facebook and Instagram as well. Do more videos like this in the future, follow us on YouTube. Until then, I'll see you next time.